Hi everyone, welcome back to another gameplay of Infinito 32. So I'm gonna continue uh, showing you uh, how to complete the quest in the brand new bonus levels uh, that have been added in this, in this last update. And yeah, I'm gonna do it with you. Now the very last bonus level, the fifth one. And uh, now in my last video, I forgot to say it, but of course uh, the um, the difficulty on which you're playing and how much research you have definitely is gonna influence uh, how easy or not achieving and completing the quests can be. So uh, yeah, that's remember always that. So in this particular uh, case, you can see the map is quite um, well different from the usual, and the, the base is gonna be actually up here, and there is a teleport. So when the enemies reach this point right here, they're gonna automatically teleport into the base. So it's pretty much uh, game over. So now here the three quests are damage dealt during one game, uh, enemies killed during one game, and then coins gained during one game. Now these three quests are very very easy because of the fact that the first two, if you can survive the 80 total rounds that uh, there are in this particular uh, game, you can pretty much um, guarantee that you can complete the damage quest and the enemy skill quest. So uh, yeah, that's one thing. Then second thing for the coins gained, as usual, if you go with uh, bounties and if you try to place bounties in the early game and stuff like that, you should be more than capable of uh, um, getting the um, uh, completing also the coins gained during one game. So yeah, that's it. So I'm going to start with these towers uh, as usual, and uh, yeah, let's go. So in this particular map, um, there are both flying enemies and there is also a boss. And as you saw before, the boss is going to be in wave 41. Um, and then that's pretty much it. So yeah, just remember about that. So here I'm going to place another missile in this uh, power 5 modifier, uh, sorry, uh, tile. And there is also here a core um, that is... Um, I mean, it's not that uh, good, uh, but uh, yeah, it's gonna make you able to get more damage. And uh, yeah, especially like damage and uh, more explosion range for the cannon. And I think then also here attack speed, I think are the most, the three most important things that you get uh, out of the, of the score. So yeah, definitely better having it than not. It's just some extra stuff. Um, okay, just two missiles for now should be more than fine and uh, uh, yeah, just dropping the bounties, getting the extra coins. Um, and I think right here I'm gonna just drop a blast tower. Uh, no wait, not here, but uh, here. Just to force the enemies to go a longer way around and also here. So yeah, just uh, always remember to use your towers whenever you're playing on endless or enemies can walk on platforms. Remember to um, to make the path longer, just uh, by blocking uh, the enemies. And uh, yeah. Now uh, here I'm getting everything level two. I think it's just the best idea. And uh, yeah, so these three quests should be very easy, as I said, to complete. Uh, now here I'm gonna get even more damage with my towers, so even easier should be. And uh, um, let's get here another blast tower, so enemies are forced here to go into the right side. Yeah, here we go. Um, so let's drop now another bounty. Can I get anything here? No. Uh, you could be using as well these damage tiles to place like more missiles, but in this case, I don't think right now it's that uh, necessary. So I'm gonna just keep on using the towers I've placed. Um, maybe later on in the game it's gonna be uh, important, but yeah, so far I think it is more than enough. 
um, and uh, yeah, you can see coins gained once you start dropping a lot of bounties. It becomes this is actually becomes the fastest quest that you complete. Um, and uh, now here, most likely, I'm gonna just get uh, yeah explosion range for the cannons. Why not? Um, dropping here another bounty. Do I have any free spot? Yeah, here I have one spot, and I have one spot here, and also here. Yeah, yeah, it's free. There are a lot of, of uh, spots that you can use. Um, okay, so let's actually move at the this minor this bounty right here. Now this is the boss, and um, yeah, I think already like everything level four, level three should be enough to defeat the boss because the boss is gonna take the longer way around. But yeah, just in case, I'm gonna just increase these cannons level four. Um, yeah, also here some jet enemies were able to sneak past. Uh, maybe I don't know. I didn't see how many lives I had at the beginning. Um, and yeah, let's just drop the very last two bounties here in the middle. Um, and uh, yeah, let's actually get now uh, two more missiles. Especially for the flying enemies, for the flying jets, enemies are always uh, very annoying. And uh, yeah, that's the last bounty. Uh, you can see the coins gained, I already completed it. I completed the damage dealt. And now it's just about completing the last quest of enemies killed. Right, level 5. Um, and here... Um, yeah, I don't even know if I'm gonna have enough. I may be able to complete this quest before I can get the extra attack speed. So let's actually get uh, these missiles as well, level 5, just to have more range to start attacking more the enemies. Um, okay, yeah, good. And I think now, yeah, just getting everything level 6, I think is gonna be enough until pretty much the end. Uh, or until I can complete the quest. Uh, and yeah, that's it. So this is a strategy, like my usual strategy. Cannons, freezing, uh, missiles, and blast towers will never need it. Um, and yeah. So the first three quests are going to be completed. As soon as I complete this one with the enemy skill, I'm going to just exit from the game. Because uh, yeah, this level has 80 total waves, but uh, yeah, you can complete uh, the enemy skill quest a lot earlier than that. Um, yeah, I can even get... Yeah, here we go. So, the three quests completed. Let's end the game right now. Collect the rewards. A lot of bitters. Nice. And then the last two... Uh, quests are uh, once again the score gained in one game that is uh, once again pretty high to 60,000 and then the save time by wave calls uh, once again uh, pretty much uh, very similar to the fourth bonus level and yeah let's go now uh, here I didn't see but yeah you can see that the base this time is standard so you're not gonna give gain any bonuses with the base uh, so here I'm gonna just do exactly the same as before. So I'm gonna drop the same towers I'm gonna do pretty much the same uh, Strategy, but this time instead of dropping a bounty at the beginning. I'm gonna drop a minor And yeah in this way now I'm gonna start um, Stacking the double mining speed plus uh, yeah, Getting some resources and start uh, increasing the score so here we go, another missile right here, pretty much uh, exact as before. Uh, now I'm gonna drop here bounty. Um, yeah, just uh, continuing on with the central path. Getting here, um, yeah, these top towers, level one. And uh, um, 
probably also missiles level 1 just to be able to attack more the, the enemies. Um, okay, next I'm gonna just drop uh, more bounties down here. Uh, they save time by wave calls. If I see that uh, I'm approaching the last, like, uh, I don't know, 15 uh, waves, and I'm still very far from the number that I need to complete the quest, then uh, I'm gonna just activate here Insta Auto Wave Call, and yeah, I'm gonna just use that to get through and to achieve that quest. I think it's not gonna, they shouldn't give me any problems. So I'm gonna drop here one more uh, bounty. And now getting the cannons level two. Freezing level two and missiles as well level two. All right. So it's pretty much uh, as before, but this time remember Miners, important for the score quest. Um, and yeah, here we go. Now more damage. Nice. Now, I don't know if actually making the path longer means that the enemies will exit from the cannon range. So, um, yeah, I don't know if it's better to block the enemies from walking through these platforms. At least right now, then. When I can have the cannons with a more range, then it's gonna be fine. So here, yeah, uh, double mining speed. And um, yeah, let's get now these cannons level 3, freezing level 3, and missiles level 3. Uh, I'm most likely now I'm gonna drop, I'm gonna place more missiles. So I'm gonna do something different from before. Um, and I think in this way I'm gonna start leveling up these missiles. Ah, uh, yeah, it's gonna be better at the end of the day. So let's drop here actually a um, another a miner, but this time for inferior. Now this resource is very slow, but because it's uh, it has more value at the end of the day, it's pretty much uh, the the same amount of score that you can gain out of it. Um, so yeah, I think uh, it works. So I'm gonna actually now use the miners to block the path. And again, here the boss should be uh, fine. Oh, I placed the, the bounty too late. The enemies can go through. Oh, that's so sad though. Yeah, but I should be able to defeat the boss anyway. Yeah, okay. I got a little scared, but nothing too terrible. Uh, actually, now this bounty, I'm gonna just replace it back here. I'm gonna use this spot and uh, everything level 4. I'm trying to stay on 2000 coins total. Um, and uh, now, here, most likely, I'm gonna drop the, the blast towers. And here I'm gonna actually drop a mining speed uh, modifier. Uh, and then I need one more uh, bounty, and let's just place it right there. Trying not to place it close to any offensive tower, so in that way I can uh, I can gain uh, I can keep on gaining the coins for from the kills. And now uh, here, very important. Um, once you place all the bounties, it's important just placing now the miners uh, and yeah, trying to boost that uh, mining uh, that, that score. And in this case, you can see that I'm placing first these miners right here with the resources that are mined uh, slower, but uh, in this case are closer to the uh, to the left side. And in this way, now I can place these miners, for example, and I can just. Uh, uh, mine more so without even upgrading them like level one or stuff like that I can uh, already mine more because of the fact that I can place these mining speed modifiers and um, 
Now here I think getting everything level 5 I need to remember to uh, to still like upgrade my my towers to defeat the enemies. In this case I'm gonna get mining speed first uh, because again like it's something to get uh, even more score. So yeah definitely doing that. Then yeah I got uh, explosion range for cannon and now I'm gonna just continue here with the right side. Um, Okay, so let's upgrade now. This last me of level five. All right, you can see the enemies actually are a little tougher than uh, my towers levels. So yeah, I'm struggling a little bit, but nothing too terrible. And I think right now I'm gonna just drop uh, some more um, miners. Actually, I'm gonna like place every single miner that I can. Why not? Uh, Four hundred. Um, yeah, especially right now, whatever. Right, it's just uh, more more resources, more score. And uh, yeah, actually here I'm actually overkilling it. Because uh, I need to... Um, I'm gonna get the score right now. So I've already completed that. But I actually need to get the, uh, the save time. So I'm gonna actually now activate Insta Auto Waco. And yeah, I'm gonna just continue with this. So hopefully I will be able to defend here, um, because a lot of enemies will start coming out, and I've spent a lot of cash on uh, on the miners. So yeah, hopefully it's gonna be fine. If anything, I can always use uh, uh, an ability here. Yeah, let's drop it. Why not? Um, yeah, why not? Just to clean up once, uh, and yeah, in this way now I can complete also the save time quest. And uh, yeah, I think that's pretty much it. So yeah, probably I think I overdid it with the miners. Uh, probably I should have upgraded more my offensive towers instead of placing these many miners. Uh, and yeah, in that way you should be able to complete as, as well the save quest uh, earlier on. I completed it right at the very last round actually, that was very very close. I was very close at not uh, achieving the, the quest. So yeah, definitely here I made a mistake with the uh, miners, I just placed too many of them. I should have upgraded the, the towers instead. And here it's okay, I'm gonna just uh, lose some lives, whatever. Uh, yeah, that was the last wave. So yeah, definitely... Um, I, I could complete it, but it was a, a very close uh, close one. So yeah, getting a ton of bitters, that's what I like to see. And uh, here we go, so that's uh, the fifth bonus level, so hope you guys enjoyed, and see ya, bye bye.